Ho, ho, ho from Loloho. It's that special time of year again, Black Friday month. <laughs> Remember when Black Friday was just a day? A single day. <laughs> so every year we come to you with some gift ideas for RV owners. This year our least expensive gift is a couple of bucks and our most expensive gift is 115,000 bucks. You had to be really, really good this year to deserve that gift, right? And, but we're gonna start on the other end of the spectrum with a stocking stuffer. These are magnetic hooks mm -hmm. and they hold a lot more weight than you expect. These are super strong. Yeah, super strong magnets. We have a bunch of them hanging right by the door and we have added a lot of storage space in our RV by using these little magnetic hooks. Next up are these rechargeable LED strip lights. We use these all over our camper. Anytime there is a nook or cranny where we need a light and there isn't one there, we use these. They attach to a little metal strip so you can take them in and out to recharge them. They also have a setting where it's motion detected. We probably have 20 of them throughout our camper. In the bottom of the closet, just all sorts of places where you need a light and there usually isn't one. These are great for the 4 a.m. trip to the bathroom. <laughs> when you're stumbling through the dark, you can just wave your hand in front of them and yes. they'll light up. Next up, for you organizational freaks out there, I'm not the most organized person on the planet and that's an understatement, but I have improved my organizational skills with this label maker. Uh, I put labels on all of my camera gear, for example, in the RV. I put labels on the storage bins. So I really love <laughs> this little label gun it's around 15 or 20 bucks something like that and the refills of label tape are really cheap you can get three for I think 10 bucks all right, speaking of organization, everybody has things in their bathroom or kitchen or whatever that you don't have to access a lot, but you still need. First aid goodies, makeup remover wipes, extra soap or what have you. And these bins are awesome because they're stackable and they have these lids with this little indentation on the top so that when you stack them on top of each other, they don't slide around. So when they're under the cabinet in the Airstream or going down the road and it's doing like this, this top one stays put. But nice special just... effect. And you have other containers in there as well. It yeah. completely transformed that area <laughs> where everything used Made to just work. be piled up. <laughs> now it looks nice and clean. Yes, and you can actually find things. You can actually see what's under there. You're not just blindly guessing. Next, we're gonna go to one of the fundamentals, <laughs> water. We all need water, yes. right? We're RV camping. This little plastic water hose grab handle costs awesome. like less than five bucks, I think, on Amazon. And uh, it really is awesome. It's well worth the money yes. they charge for it. Next, we're gonna get a little bit high tech and I'm gonna talk <laughs> about lithium power stations. Yes. And we carry several of these. This is a small one, Rockman. I think this is a couple hundred bucks. This is the EB150, the Bluetti Junior by uh, Maxo. We love these devices because they are so useful around an RV. Yes. In a nutshell, this is a lithium battery paired with an inverter and outlets. So you can charge your portable electronic devices, you can recharge your phones, your drones, you can run small appliances with these. We so. actually loaned this one to some friends when it was super cold weather and they used an electric blanket heated by this little power bank right here and it lasted them all night long and really saved them in some sub-freezing temperatures. The Blue Eddy right here and we plugged in this electric blanket throw and man that kept us toasty warm all night. And it was 28 degrees last night. Yeah. So the inverter um, worked great. Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> Next, the always popular solo, solo stove. stove. This is the bonfire model. Yes. Uh, solo stove is basically a portable fire pit. And what makes it so awesome is the way that it burns the fire. It has these little holes drilled in the bottom, holes drilled in the top, and it sort of funnels airflow through the container kind of up and out. It helps your fire light easier like when you make the fire now it's super easy to do it also keeps the smoke out of your face so we found that even when we go to national parks and there's a fire pit we will typically use our solo stove 
instead of the campsite fire pit. And I've never spoken with anyone who owned one of these who didn't like it. I mean, a lot of people really like them and end up buying more than one, <laughs> which is a great testimonial. Yeah. Next up is our Traeger pellet grill. We have a great portable one that we brought with us this year on the road and we have used it a ton and it's so easy to use. You can either plug it into your camper or you can plug it into one of those lithium power banks that Sean showed earlier. Either Either way it just makes cooking so easy there's no you know open flame that you have to worry about there's no charcoal that you have to worry about finding and it makes your food taste so good it's nice and smoky we're typically using the Traeger once or twice a week at least yeah and so. we haven't had a bad meal off of it yet next up I am constantly asked what kind of drone do you recommend and I want to quickly remind you I have a second channel on YouTube called the Shawn Michael simulation where I occasionally talk about photography and drones this is my current favorite drone it is the DJI Mavic Air 2 the Mavic Air 2 I think is probably the best all-around drone for most people. Now, if you are really just wanting to spend a little less and get an entry level drone, then I would recommend you look to the Mavic Mini 2 or the original Mavic Mini. But the Mavic Air 2 is fantastic and it's pretty much all the drone anyone would ever need. All right, the next item on our list is something that you have seen on Seymour. It's the Retrax Pro retractable tonneau cover. It's been really awesome because it's super easy to use. It keeps everything inside nice and dry. You can lock it. It's a metal cover. It's mm -hmm. very strong on top. I mean, you mm -hmm. can set items on top of it if you want to. You can mount rack storage on top of it. So mm -hmm. we actually have our Thule storage unit resting kind of on top of this cover. This particular cover has what they call T-slots built into it. And so it's really easy to add crossbars that you can put storage boxes on or you can put bike racks on or kayak holders on or ski racks on, all sorts of things. <laughs> yeah, in addition to that Retrax cover, which has been brilliant, mm -hmm. I would highly recommend that Thule storage unit mm -hmm. because now we put all of the clutter associated with RV camping in that Thule. Everything that we have to access whenever we're setting up or breaking down a campsite. So those pieces together, the Retrax cover and the Thule and so forth will cost around $3,000. Yeah. So that's a pretty big ticket expense. But the even bigger ticket expense <laughs> is the $115,000 gift idea we're going to show you. It's currently located here at Vinny's North Bay Airstream Repair. Let's take a look at one of the nicest Airstreams I have ever seen for sale, period. This is a 33-foot front queen bedroom Airstream 2018 model. It's a classic, which means it's got the wood cabinetry, Corian countertops, all the premium finishings. You've got a large refrigerator. It's probably double the size of the refrigerator we have in our trailer. You've got stainless steel appliances, propane stove and cooktop, a convection microwave. You've got a dinette, really comfortable couch. All the furniture is finished with a nice ultra leather. And you've got this control panel. This is one of my favorite features of the trailer. You can control all sorts of things on the trailer. For example, if I wanted to lift day and night shades, I can do so with a touch of the screen. You can see the shades are now coming up automatically. And this trailer also features a projection system. So instead of a TV, you've got a drop-down screen, which is huge, that you can project your internet or TV content onto. Finally, it's got the nicest bathroom I've ever seen in an Airstream. You've got a large cedar-lined master closet here and really just beautiful finishings. Nice sink a real toilet that's porcelain and a gigantic shower. You've even got features like heated towel bar 
and there's a radiator that wraps the perimeter of the trailer to keep it warm in winter time which is the best technology Airstream offers so this really has all the bells and whistles and very classic traditional styling that is going to always be in style so it's really just a beautiful trailer and it's going to be a great deal for someone I know I would like to have it myself this is an opportunity for somebody to get into the nicest Airstream they make at a great discount and Danny himself can vouch for every aspect of it so if you're somebody that wants to jump in or you want to just upgrade what you've got then this might be the RV for you so if you see this video and you're really interested in it call Vinny tell him you saw the video it made me think long and hard about getting it yeah I had to pull him out of it the other day he was sitting in there saying wow this is really nice I could really get used to this this is I really like this it is nice so, so I had to I had to say come on step away step away <laughs> We want to thank all of you for your support of Long Long Honeymoon throughout the year. Really, our Amazon store is a great means of support for us. Yes. We're going to have a special category in our store that lists a lot of these items we've talked about today. Even though 2020 has had its fair share of ups and downs, mostly downs, yeah. enjoyed being back on the road so much. We hope that you and yours have a wonderful holiday season wherever you're celebrating. If you plan on buying any of your Christmas gifts for anyone that you know through Amazon, please use our link. You can buy anything that Amazon sells as long as you start your shopping experience at our URL, which is amazon.com slash shop slash long, long honeymoon. Finally, the most expensive item, oh, yeah. <laughs> and that is my personal Hutzler 571 oh, banana wow. slicer. I am willing to part with this for $116,000. <laughs> $116,000 and my personal banana slicer can be yours yes. and I will show up and deliver it to you yep. <laughs> as we travel across the country in our 2018 33 foot Airstream Classic. <laughs> so banana slicer. And a visit from Sean. And I mean. a visit, personal visit. And this banana slicer did go all the way to Cambodia with us. Yep. It's been around the world. This is an internationally famous banana slicer. <laughs> so $116,000 and it can be yours. Yep. <laughs> Thanks guys. Lolo ho. Lolo ho.